Hey you guys, welcome back. Um, it should be obvious that we are not in the art studio right now. I thought it was such a beautiful day and I would hate to miss it, so we are bringing yoga out on my front porch. Um, some of you that are in my other group um, have seen me out on my back porch, and this is the front porch. So anyways, welcome and enjoy. I literally just moved my plants from one place to the other because I love them and they make me happy. So, whenever you're ready, go ahead and come on down to your mat. Make sure you're uh, getting yourself nice and comfortable down here, sitting up nice and tall. Have your water, so that way we can do some yoga together. And I think everything is uh, set up all good for you guys to see me and to hear me. Um, so hopefully you guys will enjoy nature, hear some of the beautiful sounds that are around us, and feel a little more relaxed for this evening. So, that being said, make your way down to your mat if you haven't gotten there already. Come into a comfortable cross-legged position. Make sure you're sitting up nice and tall. Go ahead and take a sip of your water before we begin. All right, so you should be sitting up nice and tall, legs crossed, bring your hands into your lap and go ahead and close your eyes. And we're just gonna focus on that breath. Take a big inhale in through the nose and out. Even bigger breath in. Exhale, let it go. One more in and out. Great job. Go ahead and bring your left hand to your heart, your right hand to your belly. And again, we're gonna focus on that breath, but I want you to feel your entire body expanding forward. Inhale. And as you exhale, pull your abs in, press that air out. Do that again, in and out. One more, in and out. Great job. Go ahead and bring your hands right onto your sides here. And the goal is to feel our rib cages pushing from the left to the right. Take a big inhale. And exhale again. Use your abs. Press that air out. Inhale. Expand your ribs to those side walls. Exhale. Let it go. One more time. In and out. Great job. Just go ahead and allow yourself to get comfortable here. Bring your hands back onto your lap. Keep your eyes closed. And we're gonna stay here for several more breaths, just focusing on being present, being still, and taking all of our attention away from our randomized thoughts and right into our breath. Feel your, the weight of your body getting a little heavier into your mat. Make sure you're sitting up nice and tall. Pull your chin back in space, really working on that alignment. And begin noticing how that breath feels as it enters into the body and as it exits. Before we move through any of our poses and get into any type of a sequence, I want us to just really quickly do an entire body scan. We're gonna start at the top of our head, working our way all the way down to our toes. And I want you to notice what's going on. Notice what feels just fine. Notice what maybe is a little uncomfortable and we're just gonna pay attention to those things as we move down our body. So with that next inhale, bring your attention all the way up to the top of your head. And begin working your way down through your head, maybe into your jaw, down your neck, into your shoulders. Make sure you're relaxing them down your spine. You can scan down through your chest your arms, down into your ribs, your 
belly, your low back, your hips, down into your tailbone, down your thighs, your calves and your shins, down to your ankles, your feet, and your toes. And again, just acknowledge what is going on in the body, right? The more we are aware and in tune with our body, the more we can advocate for ourselves with the poses that come later. Meaning, if you know that you're tight in your hips or your low back, well, don't go into such a big stance. Keep it a little shorter, right? We always do what is right for our bodies, no matter what I, as your instructor, am telling you. Because we are different people, we have different body mechanics, and we're going to look different in these poses. And that's completely okay. So as long as you're listening to the proper postural things, like turning your pelvis or really lifting through the arch of your foot, that's more important than getting this big stance. So. I hope you guys are ready and go ahead take a big inhale and exhale and you can go ahead and open your eyes with that next inhale lift your arms all the way up towards the sky look up and as you exhale float your arms down to your side inhale lifting and exhale lower one more just like that in and out Great, leave your hands down at your hips. Inhale, lift your shoulders. I almost said elbows. <laughs> lift your shoulders up to your ears. Exhale, drop them back and down your spine. Bring a big smile on your face as you continue to move through that motion, connecting it to your breath. Inhale as you lift and exhale as you lower. We'll do two more. Great job. With your next inhale, bring your hands forward, palms together, holding them there. Inhaling in and out. With that next inhale, glide your right arm across your body. Open it up to the wall or the space behind you. And go ahead and turn your gaze. Look over that right shoulder. Elongate through your fingers. Really stretch them out here. Take a big inhale and exhale. Notice if you're holding tension in the left side, just call attention to it, give a little shimmy shake, and then let it relax. And focus on that breath. In and out. One, he one more here. In. And as you exhale, bring that hand forward. Take a big inhale. And exhale, we'll open up that left arm this time. Look over your left shoulder. Ooh, there's a cute little bunny back behind me right now. That's something to hold my gaze on. Focus on that breath. Big inhale and exhale. We're going to stay here for two more breaths. In and out. Last one. In. And as you exhale, bring that arm forward. And I want you to go ahead and bring your elbows right into your side, keeping your palms faced up to the ceiling right in front of you. The goal of this next pose is to simply pull our thumbs towards that wall behind us and keeping your elbows into your side. So hands out front, take a big inhale. And as we exhale, pull your thumbs back. Feel your shoulder blades rolling in towards your spine. Use your body to contract your shoulder blades in that manner. Inhale, bring your hands forward. Exhale, open them up. Inhale, exhale. In and out. Make sure you're smiling. We're out in nature, come on. Two more. Last one. Great, go ahead and bring your hands right onto your knees, tucking your fingers right underneath of your kneecaps. With that next inhale, press your chest forward, bend at your elbows, look up towards the sky, but don't crank your head back. Inhale, and as you exhale, pull your back towards the wall behind you. Tuck your chin into your chest, feel a rounding, like you're turning into the letter C, and tuck your tailbone up towards the sky here. Inhale, lengthen, come forward. Exhale, round, send it back. Inhale, and exhale. 
two more. In, out, last one. Great job. Come on up into that nice tall position here. Take a breath. In, and as you exhale, we're going to shift onto our all fours here, coming into our tabletop position. Go ahead and plant your palms right underneath of your shoulders here and your wrist or your knees <laughs> right underneath of your hips. Go ahead and keep the tops of your feet planted down into the floor and just send your gaze out past your nose. Take a big inhale and exhale, let it go. Inhale, drop that belly, send your hips to the sky, look forward without cranking your head back. And as you exhale, pull your spine towards the ceiling, tuck your tailbone under, tuck your chin into your chest. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, round. Inhale. And exhale. Keep that going. Two more here. Great job. Come back into that neutral tabletop position. And I want you to take your right foot, send it out to the side, plant the bottom of your foot down onto the floor. Go ahead and curl your left toes under. Inhale, come into a nice flat back. Exhale, send your hips towards that back wall until you can feel a stretch in that inner thigh here. Lift your ankle away from the ground. Inhale, come forward. Exhale, back. Inhale, make sure you're really pressing your hands into your mat, spreading all of your fingers nice and wide here. Keep it going, moving with your breath. We're getting some stretching through our leg, but we're also working through the bottom of that left foot. We're working on some of our wrist flexion here. We're really working a lot of body parts. We'll go two more. Last one. Great job. Go ahead and pull that right leg in, curl those toes under, and then send your left leg out. Again, lifting the arch of that foot. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, sink it back. Finding your breaking point and don't pushing it any farther. Keep it going. <clears throat> I really hope you guys can hear the birds because they just are so refreshing right now. We'll go three more. Two. And last one. Great. Come back into our tabletop position. Curl both of your toes under. Take a big inhale. And as you exhale, send your hips to the sky. Tuck your chest towards your thighs here. Downward facing dog. Turn your elbows the elbow creases towards that front wall like you're trying to turn your biceps towards the ceiling. Inhaling in and out. One more breath here. In and as you exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Release that upper body over your lower body. Make sure you have a nice big bend in your knees so we can open up through that low back here. Tuck your chin into your chest and just feel that lengthening through your entire spine. Focus on your breath here. It might feel a little more labored, pressing that upper body into the lower body. Just keep it slow and steady. With your next inhale, glide your hands up to your shins, straighten through your legs, straighten through that upper body here like you're the figure seven. Take a big inhale. And exhale, forward fold. Release your upper body over the lower body. Inhale, lengthen into our halfway lift again, that figure seven. And exhale, fold. Inhale. And exhale. One more. In. And out. And with that next inhale, we're gonna slow and controlled, roll all the way up to standing, straightening through your legs first, tucking that tailbone under, rolling up through the low back, the mid back, the upper back, 
loop your shoulders back and down your spine, lengthen through your neck, lengthen through the top of your head, pull your chin back in space. Bring your hands right at your sides. Take a big inhale in and out. One more breath here, in and out. And just feel yourself grounding in through your feet into the floor. With that next inhale, bend your knees, draw a giant circle as you stand all the way back up. Give me a slight back bend at the top. And as you exhale, forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Go ahead and plant your palms. Step one foot back and then the other, shifting into plank, sending your body weight forward so your wrists are right underneath of your shoulders here. Pull that belly button into your spine. Really turn your inner thighs up towards the ceiling here. Inhaling in. And with our exhale, we're gonna move through our first vinyasa. Keep your elbows into your side and slowly lower all the way down. You can always drop onto your knees if you need to. Uncurl your toes. Inhale, press into your hands. Lift your entire upper body away from that mat. Tuck those shoulder blades down your spine. Tone through your glutes here so you can protect that low back. Inhaling in. And as we exhale, curl your toes under. Open your knees as wide as your mat. Send your hips to your heels. Keeping your arms extended out in front of you. Release your forehead down to the mat. So go ahead and close your eyes as we move into child's pose. Just focus on your breath here. Take a big inhale in through the nose. Exhale, let it go through the mouth this time. <sighs> inhale. Exhale. <sighs> One more, in and out. <sighs> Great, just let that breath come to a nice normal rhythm in and out through the nose. I want you to bring a smile onto your lips and think of one thing that you're grateful for from today. with your next inhale, find your flow all the way back up to our tabletop position, bringing your knees right underneath of your hips, wrists under your shoulders, nice flat back here. Go ahead and curl your toes under, take a big inhale in, and as you exhale, send your hips to the sky, downward facing dog, and see if you can release your heels a little closer to the ground here, and if not, that's okay. It's okay if you have a big bend in your knees as well. Inhaling in and out. Make sure you're turning your biceps towards that ceiling here. Press into the first finger knuckle. Really help ground yourself, locking your arms in this position. Inhaling in and out. With your next breath, bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Come into our forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, bend your knees. Draw me that big circle as you stand all the way back up, arms up and overhead. And exhale, release your palms together down at your heart. Take a breath there. Inhaling in and out. One more breath in and out. Great. Go ahead and step to the center of your mat. I'm going to dust off all of this tree pollen, you guys. It's insane right now. <laughs> Go ahead and point your toes towards that front wall. Open your legs as wide as you are comfortable. Take a big inhale and sweep your arms all the way back up. And as we exhale, send your hips to the wall behind you. Come into our halfway lift bending right at your hip here. And as you exhale, 
allow your upper body to release all the way down. If you need to, have a slight bend in your knees. Tuck your chin into your chest. Press into your fingertips. Inhale, lengthen, coming into that nice flat back. And exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, holding it there. We're going to plant that left palm right on the ground in front of us, right under your nose. And as you inhale, open that right arm all the way up to the sky. You can find a movement in your legs that's comfortable to you, or you can just stay standing still. <clears throat> Take a big inhale. And as you exhale, release that right hand down. Send your left arm all the way up. Focus on that breath. Inhaling in and out. Two more breaths here. Last one. Release that hand down. Bend your knees. Bring your hands right at your hips. Slow and controlled. Roll all the way up to standing. Take a big inhale in at the top. Exhale. Let it go. Go ahead and turn your feet to the left side of that mat, that front foot facing forward, and your back foot at a slight angle towards the center of your mat. Feel the weight in the back side of your foot lifting in that arch. Inhale, get a slight bend in that front knee. Send your arms forward and up. Holding it here in our warrior one. And if you need to, step that back leg in. Find something that's comfortable for you tiny, tiny movements within the body, even in that shorter stance, are still really elongating all of those muscles. So don't feel like just by stepping forward, you're not getting enough. Focus on that breath. Inhale. And as you exhale, open your arms to those side walls. Make sure your chest is facing that front wall. Look over your front hand here. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, exhale, one more in, and with that next exhale, go ahead and straighten through that front leg, and we're going to tip forward, allowing that front arm to come down wherever it's comfortable to, lifting that back arm all the way up to the sky. You can look down towards the mat, towards the wall in front of you, or up towards the sky here. Find what's comfortable for you. Make sure you're lifting in the arch of that back ankle. Pull that top shoulder blade towards the back wall. Inhaling in and out. One more breath here. In. And with that next exhale, go ahead and cartwheel your hands down to the front of the mat. Step your foot back, coming into our plank position, and move through your vinyasa. Slowly lowering all the way down. Inhale, lifting into our up dog, pressing through your hands here, engaging your glutes. And exhale, curling those toes under, sending your hips back to your heels, arms out ahead. Forehead all the way down to the mat. Close your eyes and listen to that blue jay soothe you as you come all the way down and surrender. Just focus on that breath. Inhaling in. And out. Inhale. And exhale. Bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. With your next inhale, find your flow all the way up to downward facing dog. Focusing on your breath here, really working on getting the correct posture. 
and we'll stay here for three big breaths. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, exhale, two to go. In and out. Last one. With your next inhale, go ahead and bend your knees, look forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle, all the way up. Palms together, bring them to your heart. Take a breath. Go ahead and step to the center of your mat, facing the front of the room again. Point your toes forward, open your legs as wide as you can, and with that next inhale, fix all of your clothes, and then sweep your arms all the way up to the sky. Look up, big smile. Exhale, slow and controlled, forward fold. Slight bend in those knees. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Bring your hands right onto your hips. Slow and controlled, stand all the way back up. We're gonna turn our feet to the right side this time. Again, front foot pointing forward back foot pointing towards that center line of your mat, a slight angle, lifting in that arch. Turn your chest forward and inhale, lift your arms up and overhead. Turn your thumbs outward towards those side walls. So we're really engaging through the side of your body here. No compression in your shoulders. Bend in that front knee. Take a big inhale and exhale. One more, in. And as we exhale, open up into our warrior two. Chest forward, arms lengthened. Look over that front hand, keeping that knee bent. Inhaling in and out. Inhale and exhale. One more breath here, in. And as you exhale, straighten through that front leg, bump your hips to that wall behind you, and tip over to the right like you're a teapot. You know it was fun. You heard the song in your head. Just go with it. Take a big inhale, look up towards the ceiling, or send your gaze down towards the floor as I try to catch that mosquito. Focus on your breath here, inhaling in, and out. One more breath here. In. And as we exhale, we're going to come all the way back up to standing and cartwheel to the left side of our mat. Go ahead and plant your palms, step it back, and move through your vinyasa. And go ahead and take it back into your child's pose. You can keep your knees into center if you'd like to open up through that low back even more. Got him or you can open up those legs and open up through your hips, just like we've done before. Release your forehead all the way down to the mat. Close your eyes. You can keep your arms extended out in front. You can pull them in right under your shoulder and allow your shoulders to roll forward as we just surrender here. If your knees are in at the center line, pull your hands all the way back to your feet here and flip your palms open to the sky and just focus on that breath. Inhaling in and out. Bring a big smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for from today.
with your next inhale, bring your hands right under your shoulders if they're not there already, and press your upper body away from the floor. Sending your hips to your heels and coming up nice and tall in your spine. Bring your hands right on your laps. Pull your chin towards the wall behind you, elongating through your entire spine from the top of your head to your tailbone. And just focus on your breath here for a moment. Inhaling in and out. Release your shoulders down. One more breath here. In and out. With your next inhale, send your body weight forward, curl your toes under, and send your hips back towards your heels. So we can get a nice stretch through the bottoms of our feet. If the pressure is too much, just lift up and out of your hips just slightly. <clears throat> Again, sitting up nice and tall here, chin tucked back. Inhale and exhale. Two more breaths here. In. Out, last one. Great, shift your body weight forward. Send your legs to one side or the other and make your way all the way down into a seat with your legs extended out in front of you. You might wanna shift your bottom to about halfway on your mat. Bring your palms right at your hips onto the floor and sit up nice and tall. See if you can lengthen even more than you're used to here. And again, pull your chin back in space. Loop those shoulders so you're opening up through the chest here. Inhale, exhale. Notice that breathing might become a little labored, and that's okay. That's how we begin to strengthen all those muscles in our front body and stabilize the ones in our back body. One more breath here, in and out. Inhale, lift your arms all the way up to the sky. And exhale, fold over your lower body, catching wherever it's comfortable to you. Maybe it's your shins, maybe it's your ankles, maybe you can get to the bottom of your feet. Every day it could be different. So find what's comfortable for you here, no straining. Tuck your chin into your chest. Inhale, lengthen, roll yourself all the way back up. And exhale, let it go. Give your upper body a little shimmy shake. Give your legs a little shimmy shake. And then when you're ready, go ahead and take that left leg, place it outside of your right knee, bring the left hand back behind. Inhale, sweep your right fingers up to the sky. Exhale, connect that elbow to the outside edge of your knee and go ahead and look over your left shoulder here. Press into that left palm, lengthening through your arm, lifting that body. Focus on your breath. Inhaling in and out. Relax through that right hand. Part your lips just slightly so you can relax through your jaw. With your next inhale, send both of your arms to the opposite side of your mat for a counter twist. And then inhale back to center and we'll switch sides. Place that right leg outside of the left knee. Bring the right hand back behind, planting your palm down. Inhale, left fingertips to the sky. Exhale, twist and connect. Look over that right shoulder. Find what's comfortable for you here and just breathe. Ignore my noisy neighbors as they drive by. Just kidding, they're good people. Heart through your lips if you need to, to release through that jaw. And we'll stay here for one more breath. In and out. With that next inhale, twist to the opposite side for that counter twist. And inhale, come all the way back up. Plant the bottoms of your feet down onto the mat. Inhale, lengthen your arms forward, palms open to the ceiling. Take a big inhale. And as you exhale, slow and controlled, 
release your upper body all the way down to the mat. Extend your arms overhead, get in a big stretch, and then slowly release one leg and then the other. And bring your hands down by your hips, opening your palms up to the sky. Allow your feet to fall open wide. Close your eyes. Take a big inhale in. And now, inhale. And exhale. As we move into our savasana, where we're still, we're present, and we just focus on that breath. And if you notice your mind starts to wander, begin to count your breath and hold your attention there. One on the inhale, two on the exhale, three, four, and keep that going until you get to 10 and then start again. With your next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers, bat your eyelashes open and closed. And when you're ready, roll onto your side facing knee, use your arm as a pillow, and we'll take a breath there. Inhaling in, and out. With your next inhale, press into the ground, Lifting your upper body and come into a comfortable cross-legged position. Sitting up nice and tall, bring your hands into your laps. Go ahead and close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose. And out. Bring your palms together all the way up to your forehead. Inhaling in. And out. Be kind in your thoughts to yourself and others. Bring your hands down to your lips. Inhaling in and out. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. Just breathe. Bring your hands down to your heart center. Inhaling in and out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Be still, be present. Take another big inhale. And as you exhale, bow forward, sealing our practice. Namaste. Thank you so much for joining me here in this digital space. I hope you enjoyed the second outdoor edition in nature and all the sounds that are so pleasant or even not. <laughs> I hope you guys are feeling a little more relaxed and uh, ready for your day. So with that, um, you guys stay happy. Stay healthy, stay hydrated, and I will see you all again soon. Bye.